This is the United States military rain poncho, flex seal. I'm gonna show you what I do about once a year to seal up these seams. I've been using these ponchos for probably 20 years. It's a ripstop nylon, it's coated. They've got a great toggle here for the hood, grommets for tying off. The hood itself is a decent size. I'd like it to be bigger, but it's a lot bigger than some of the others that I've used. You can see the stitches here all the seams. Well, that's what we're gonna go over with the um, spray. We're gonna seal those up. On the inside, you see it's got this cordage system so you can cinch it to yourself. Well, on the other side, they've stitched that in. So we need to go and spray that to seal it up too. Poncho has buttons and snaps that you can put together. You've probably all heard of the Ranger Roll. Well, I call it the um, Whoopie Burrito. I'll show you what it looks like. Before I get into that, I wanted to talk to you about subscriptions. Now, if you dig my content, you wanna see more of it, you subscribing, sharing, liking, whatever it is you do on YouTube helps out the channel, helps me out. So I appreciate it. So it's real basic. I just grab my flex seal, shake it up real good. And I come to all the seams on the outside of the garment and I just give them a spray. Now this is the bottom hem of the poncho. And you'd think, well, it doesn't really matter. It's at the bottom, so what? The water's gonna run off. Well, what I've found is that the water comes down the poncho and it pulls here on these seams and this can get real wet. So I spray all these seams all around the bottom also. Next, I'll come to these seams here where the buttons and snaps are and I'll spray those. And I'm real careful not to get these too clogged up with the spray, but once you snap them a few times, it, it melts off. Once I'm done spraying all the seams, I find a hanger, I hang it up, let it dry overnight, you'll be good to go in the morning. Here I have my Whoopie Burrito. People in the military call them Ranger Rolls. It's simply a Whoopie tied into our rain poncho. It's basically just a sleep system that you can use in warm weather. So say down into the 50s, maybe the high 40s, and it works. Super lightweight and reliable. Now talking about the Wubi, this is a great mod that I do. You basically just sew in a zipper that enables you to pop your head out of the Wubi while you're wearing it in conjunction with the US military rain poncho. If you wanna see a video on how I do that, let me know in the comments. When you combine the US military Wubi with the US military rain poncho, comes out to 2.95 pounds. So there you go. All of our seams are sealed and we will let this cure. She'll be good to go for another season.